Hey North Vancouver, happy Canada Day. Every July 1st for the past 25 years or so, we've gathered here at Waterfront Park to celebrate Canada and to express our gratitude for being Canadian. Faithfully hosted over those years by the Rotary Club of Lionsgate, we've shared together a lot of fun, song, dance, celebration, flag waving, even some colorful fashion. But for reasons that we all know very well, this year we can't gather in large groups. But that doesn't mean that we can't gather like this, virtually. So welcome and thank you for being here, wherever you are. On this unusual Canada Day then, let's begin with an unusual, though heartfelt rendition of our national anthem. And feel free to sing along. Oh. True patriot love, he knows thy sons go mad. With glowing hearts we see thee rise, the true north strong and free. From far and wide, O oh Canada, we stand on God for thee. God keep our land. Glorious and free. Oh, Canada, we stand on guard for thee. Oh, Canada, we stand on guard for thee. Hatsqual Tanoya, Siam, Tioyoqua, Canada. She talked in for Shaman Snos, Gahot Mishokamel. Just opening up in a few words of the Skahotmish people saying it's great to see each and every one of you, respected leaders, matriarchs, and Canadians. My ancestral name is Sitokton. Given name is Chris Lewis. I am a counselor of Squamish Nation, one of 16. And on behalf of our council, I want to welcome you to our traditional lands of the Skahotmish people. I'm standing on our great village of Homalterson, known as Kepilano Iyer Number 5, down at the foot of Kepilano Road. And I'm reminded of the deep history and connections that the Skahotmish people and the indigenous peoples of this land share. I'm reminded of the place names and the mythologies and the history that is not only our history as Skohomish people, but it's Canada's history. And I think it's a responsibility for all Canadians to learn the Indigenous histories of the Indigenous peoples of the land. Canada has embarked upon a special journey of reconciliation with Indigenous peoples. So as we celebrate Canada and the great history of Canada, Remember the history of Indigenous peoples that started way before Canada was confederated, but that it's your history as Canadians. It's our history as Canadians. And we have a responsibility to tell that story as we celebrate Canada Day. Happy Canada Day. Tamat Quitsi Snechem. Those are my words. Thank you. Oh, CM Nitsiaya, I Tanishkwalawan, Quitsi Kutsnali Ihui, Anta and Sakhlot. And the mana santalia eat siat mak slahot siam, and the imath queth an sakhalot queth slahot siam. Eat queth squaste mostoch, eat queth halat. Hait sepka, hait sepka, meet sep quit wheelum, eat schohot mish eat slautoth tamath. So, what I said to you in my language called hankamitnam or downriver halkamilam, my respected ones, the feelings I have inside, or I feel really good to see you and to be with you here today. And in Coast Salish way, our protocol is I introduced myself to you with my ancestral name. I carry the name Ansachlot. I am Carlene Thomas from the Slavotith Nation. And I also shared with you a little bit about my family tree. And we do that for a number of reasons, but the most important is that it informs you, the audience, that I know who I am and I know where I come from. Therefore, I know what my responsibilities are as a Wamokta. I am my grandmother. My parents are Ernie and Deanna George. My father is the current hereditary leader of our people, the Slavotith people. 
My grandparents are the late hereditary chief John L. George and the late Lillian or Dolly George as she was known to her friends. And more recently I've been adding my maternal, an acknowledgement of my maternal grandparents and um, I've been doing this for many years and I was trying to figure out why I hadn't included them before and I think it comes down to that the relationship between the three nations, our three families is beginning to heal and we've been able to step outside of the colonial processes, um, systems that had separated us. So my grandfather, my maternal grandfather is the late Stan Joseph from the Squamish Nation and my maternal grandmother is Caroline Thomas, knee Joseph knee Trimble and she's from the Niska and the uh, Snenuimo or Nanaimo people. And then I raise my hands and this in our way this is a gesture of welcome. Meet hi Tsepka, thanking all of you. Meet Sep I'm welcoming you here to the homelands and waters of the Squamish and the Slawatath people. Hi Tsepka, thank you. Thanking all of you. Well, we thank you, Carlene and Chris, for those very thoughtful words of welcome as we celebrate the Canada that is, and we focus up on the Canada that can be. Well, there's something about the vibe of North Vancouver that has long made it a, a magnet for some pretty extraordinary musical talent. Maybe it's the mountains, the trees, the traffic. In any event, we're so fortunate that again this year some very fine musicians have stepped up to share their gifts and their passion on the North Vancouver Canada Day virtual stage. Case in point, the contemporary folk group Early Spirit. At almost every performance, people ask them, are, are you a family band? But these four sons of Vancouver only are related by music, which may have something to do why, with why their first album was called Unrelated. So here to kick off our North Vancouver Canada Day musical festivities, please welcome Early Spirit. Any time? Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you, Kevin. And uh, thank you to everyone on the North Shore for joining us on this Canada Day, the most beautiful backdrop in the entire country, I reckon. But um, we're Early Spirit. We're going to do a tune that uh, is appropriate for these days. It's called We've Seen This Film Before. One, two, three. How many roads must a man drive down before he actually finds what he thought he'd found? It's there in his conscience barely a sound like so many times before. This house is on fire, tears in her eyes are the only drops of water passing his fire while the man on the hill simply waves us goodbye like so many times before. Speak up, let your voices be heard. Don't let the rattle drown out the words Let the burden fall on the mask of the absurd Cause we've seen this film before Ah, we've seen it all before Yes, the house is on fire But the alarm it doesn't sound Cause there's just too many people And they're chasing money down The tsunami's rising like to hang around Speak up, let your voices be heard Don't let the droning drown out the words Don't believe it's candy if they're handing you a turd Cause we've seen this film So many times We've watched it play out all of our lives it's unfolding right for our eyes We've seen this film
Thanks again, everybody. We're Early Spirit. Happy Canada Day. Happy Canada Day, everyone. Bon fête du Canada. Today, we proudly celebrate Canada's 153rd birthday, a milestone that provides all Canadians and those living in Canada with an opportunity to reflect on the diverse, compassionate, and prosperous nation we have built and will continue to improve together. Today, as we gather on the traditional and ancestral territories of the Squamish and Tsleil-Waututh peoples, we reaffirm our collective commitment to meaningful and lasting reconciliation with Indigenous peoples. As we look to celebrate our country today, I would encourage all of us to recommit to ensuring that Canada remains an open and welcoming country, a country where everyone, irrespective of gender, cultural background, language, religious beliefs, or sexuality, is respected for who they are and has the opportunity to realize their full potential. While Canada is not perfect, Canadians inhabit a remarkable place on Earth, one filled with natural beauty to be sure, but also one where our society truly values diversity, tolerance, equality of opportunity, and respect for the democratic process and the rule of law. Canada is a day for us to celebrate the heritage passed down to us through the works of our authors, our poets, artists, and performers. To our newest citizens of Canada, welcome. I wish you good health, prosperity, and success as you begin the journey to take advantage of all that this country has to offer. You are very much part of our Canadian family. This year, Canada Day is quite different. Instead of coming together for parades or to convene with family, friends, and neighbors, we are all continuing to practice physical distancing, doing our part to prevent the spread of COVID-19. Despite this, the ways in which we as Canadians have in recent months shown support and gratitude for our healthcare and frontline workers and respect for the health protocols that are keeping us well embrace the spirit of what it truly means to be Canadian. Je voudrais simplement dire pour ce 153e anniversaire du Canada, nous avons beaucoup à célébrer. Happy Canada Day, bonne fête du Canada. Well, thanks, Jonathan. Thanks very much. You know, in these difficult times, Rotary continues to support those in need, both locally and abroad. And if you'd like to help Rotary support local youth projects, nonprofit organizations, and international relief projects, you can make a donation online today, right now. You can find online donation buttons on both our Facebook and website pages. Just click on the buttons to go to the online donation page. And we thank you very much for your support. Well, this Canada Day, uh, perhaps more than others, it's probably fair to say that we are all feeling admiration and gratitude for North Vancouver's essential service workers. Being on the front lines of a pandemic requires courage, commitment, and caring. Tonight at 7 o'clock, let's make sure we bang those pots and pans with particular vigor throughout North Vancouver for a rousing Canada Day salute to our frontline workers. If you would like to help Rotary support local youth projects, nonprofit organizations, and international relief organizations, join our online charity auction today by bidding on some unique items, most of which are locally made. You can visit rotarylionsgate.com and click charity auction uh, to see the items that are available for sale. All right, on to the music. Deep Cove is home for our next performer. Melanie Decker credits her start in the music business to a singer at her high school who fired up her heart and made her decide that this was something that she wanted to do as well for the rest of her life. Today, she tours all over North America and Europe. She's opened for Diana Krall, Faith Hill, and performed with Russell Peters and Brian Adams. Her fans say they experience a sense of connection that's like tasting delicious chocolate. 
So if you have ever wondered what chocolate sounds like, well, here's Melanie Decker. Hello, everyone. Happy Canada Day. My name is Melanie Decker. I'm actually from Deep Cove, and it's just beautiful to be here with you today. The song is called Te Amo Mucho. Never heard my dad sing, but he sure likes to play music loud. Likes to dance up a store, the polite guy in a crowd. As a young boy at school, he was told not to open his mouth. By a daft music teacher who did not like his sound. His campfire stories reveal a tough and intelligent man. Letting go's not his strong suit, such things you cannot plan. I was there with the cowboys and Bob played his favorite song. He looked like a young man again, as if no one had ever done him the wrong. Oh, oh. Te amo mucho. I'll be damned. He sang along. As the moon shone over the divine Sierra Hills, it told us to love everything and sent us a feel good chill. I was there when the cowboys of fire played his favorite song. He looked like a young man again, as if no one had ever done him wrong. At the end of the song, the stars caught the light in his eyes. He quickly wiped away a tear that he left in those magical skies. I was there when the cowboys of Baja played his favorite song. He looked like a young man again, as if no one had ever done him wrong Te amo mucho I'll be damned He sang along Te amo mucho He sang along Enjoy the rest of the day. Happy Canada Day. My name is Grace Austin. I'm a local North Vancouver artist. Today we're down at the waterfront in North Vancouver right by the quay and we are doing a local paint of current events and what Canada means to the artists. I think that this, um, this way of celebrating is actually bringing people together in a different way so it's, it's actually very, uh, it's nice. We're meeting new people, not all the artists know each other so they get to uh, share an experience. is so special to me and we watch the fireworks and unfortunately this year it's it's altered so it's just nice that we get to do something like this to keep our community together.
send our thanks to those artists. And by the way, their work is actually uh, available for sale. Just log in to rotarylionsgate.com for more information. Well, one of the benefits of living in Lynn Valley with an earshot of Brockton School is the chance of hearing some pretty incredible music drifting through the neighborhood. If you live on the North Shore, you likely know that Brockton is an independent K-12 school, but you may not know that it is also home to the renowned Brockton School's World Music Program. Over the years, students in the program have been given uh, performances all around the world, in Canada, in China, Greece, uh, the US, Scotland, England, Austria, Germany, and the Czech Republic, and now they're about to perform in your home. Hello North Shore, this is Brockton School's World Music Program and we are so happy to be here with you today. Normally we'd be all together live at Waterfront Park celebrating our national holiday. Of course that wasn't possible this year, but thanks to the Rotary Club of Lionsgate we're able to have this amazing Canada Day celebration online. Today we're going to perform for you Coldplay's Sky Full of Stars and we hope you enjoy it.
Happy Canada Day, everyone! Hello, my name is Mike Little. I'm the mayor for the District of North Vancouver, and today it is my distinct privilege to welcome you all here to our Canada Day celebration, taking place virtually for the first time. Over the last few months, we've all had to adapt to the new normal, and the Rotary Club of Lionsgate is no exception. Uh, they've had to come up with this innovative and imaginative way for us to come together and celebrate our country's 153rd birthday. And so from me to the Rotary Club of Lionsgate, I want to express my appreciation for all you've done to help bring us together today. Being Canadian means different things to everybody. For me, it is uh, a very strong sense of uh, pride in, in community, in uh, our common bonds that tie us together, uh, our, our joint dreams for our young people that they would have a bright future with great opportunities available to them, and uh, care and compassion for the most vulnerable people in our community. We treasure our heritage. We appreciate our democratic and free society, and we welcome newcomers to our community who bring diversity and strength. It gives me great pride to not only be a District of North Vancouver resident, but also a truly proud Canadian on this, our country's birthday. On behalf of the Council and a grateful community, thank you all for joining us here today, and thank you to the organizers for creating this opportunity. We hope you all enjoy the festivities Stay safe, take care, and have a very happy Canada Day. Just wanted to say happy Canada Day from North Vancouver, Sunrise of Lim Valley. That saying that how appreciative we are from the community support in North Vancouver and everybody and all the families that supporting us during this uh, COVID-19 outbreak. We are very happy to have a safe residents and safe staff and team members and continue giving a service to our community here in North Vancouver. Happy Canada Day! Happy Hey, this is Christoph and the team from Peak Technologies. We want to let you know that we're here for businesses and the community in these crazy times. And we want to wish you a happy Canada Day. Happy Canada Day! Ah, well, those are the guys who are presenting all of the technology here for us today, so our thanks to them. All right, back to music now. North Vancouver's Jarrett Souter made the pilgrimage to Nashville, Tennessee to pursue his musical ambitions. He got a music degree there and then spent the next five years recording, songwriting, and uh, playing uh, before coming back to Vancouver, where he now teaches music and plays all over town. We're very pleased to welcome Jared Souter to our North Vancouver Canada Day virtual stage. Hey, thanks, Kevin, and thanks to Rotary for putting this on. It feels like it's been a while since I've been able to perform, so this feels pretty good. Here's a little Stevie Wonder for you.
Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? Life is Aisha. The meaning of her name. Lord, it could have not been done without you who conceived the one. But isn't she lovely? Made from love. Here's a little Bill Withers for you. See the crystal raindrops fall And the beauty of it all Is when the sun comes shining through To make those rainbows in my mind When I think of you sometime I'm gonna spend some time with you Just the two of us We can make it if we try Just the two of us Just the two of us just the two of us Building castles in the sky Just the two of us You and I We look for love but No time for tears Wasted water, all that is But it don't make no flowers grow Good things might come to those who wait But not for those who wait too late We gotta go for all we know just the two of us We can make it if we try Just the two of us Just the two of us Just the two of us Building castles in the sky Just the two of us You and I Crystal raindrops fall in the window down the hall, and it becomes the morning dew. And darling, when the morning comes and I see the morning sun, I'm gonna be the one with you. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try. Just the two of us. Just the two of us. Just the two of us Building castles in the sky Just the two of us You and I Just the two of us You and I Happy Canada, everybody. Hi, my name is Peter Roundhill and I run the website VancouversBestPlaces.com. It's a company that's based here in North Vancouver. We live here in North Vancouver. We are so lucky to be in this place. Amazing, amazing city, amazing community, wonderful people, and some of the best, absolute best places in the world to visit. From Deep Cove to Lynn Canyon Suspension Bridge to Lonsdale Key, so many wonderful places to explore. So proud to be from North Vancouver, so proud to be Canadian. Happy Canada Day, everybody. Happy Canada Day from the North Vancouver Chamber. Thank you for supporting our local businesses. Happy Canada Day, North Vancouver! Happy Canada Day from the Shipyards District in Lower Lonsdale. Thank you for supporting local business. Have a wonderful Canada Day. Well, how about some Canada Day jazz, courtesy of Andrea Superstein, one of the most versatile voices in music today. Her latest record, called Worlds Apart, has exploded onto the world scene from Tokyo to Berlin. And the song Nouveau, which you're about to hear, uh, debuted at number four on the official Spotify vocal jazz playlist just above Nora Jones. Here's Andrea Superstein. Thank you, Kevin, and hello, North Vancouver. We are so happy to be here with you on this beautiful day, Canada's birthday. My name is Andrea Superstein. My friends here here with me, Mary, Nino, and Jeff. We're gonna play a song from my most recent album, which is called Worlds Apart. The song is called Nouveau, and it's all about letting go and opening up your heart and letting love in. I think it's definitely something we can all use a lot of right now. Turn 
look at me, you smile, you grab my heart and reel me in as I melt to the floor in a pile. Ooh, I think that I love you. Ooh, I think that I do. Another day, another night, another moment. I can't live without you. In a world, I'm your girl. There's something real sweet about you. Ooh, I think that I love you. I think I do. And I think you do too. It is wrong to feel this way, even though it has been just a short time. Sometimes things just fall in place. Trust in your heart and not your mind. You jump right in to my embrace To be the one that I see in the morning And then at night, you're asleep My heart skips a beat without warning Love in, that's how you win. It's no secret that you adore me. Ooh, I think that I love you. Ooh, I think that I do. All right, everybody, get ready to play along with us. Here we go. Come on and clap your hands. And if you're sitting down, I want you to get up out of your seats and have a little boogie. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Linda Buchanan, the mayor in the city of North Vancouver, and I'd like to thank the Lionsgate Rotary Club for inviting me to participate in Canada Day online. I'd like to first acknowledge that we are gathered on the traditional territories of the Squamish and the tsleil tooth nations and thank them for sharing their lands with us. Today would have been our parade uh, where we would have met with family and friends to barbecue or see local talent down at Waterfront Park. But unfortunately, due to COVID, I want to thank the Lionsgate Rotary Club for shifting and pivoting to an online version of what we would have been doing down at Waterfront Park. So we can ex still experience our local talent, arts and culture and celebrate Canada, Canada Day, um, albeit in a very different way. But with that, I want to wish everyone a great day and happy Canada. Happy Canada Day, North Vancouver. Happy Canada Day, everyone. 
happy Canada Day from the Essential Kitchenware. Happy Canada Day, North Vancouver. Have fun. Oh, and thanks to all of you, we are having some fun here. And one of the great things about Canada Day when we can get together, not virtually, is we can see all of the color and the faces and it's always so wonderful to see. So here's just a, a selection of some of the creativity that people have put together in preparation for uh, this program today and our thanks to Blue Shore Financial uh, supporting us. As well, uh, CIBC and uh, <laughs> some more faces and some more ingenuity. It's great that Canadians aren't feeling so uptight that they can't kind of let go on Canada Day. So we appreciate all of your contributions uh, to this virtual uh, telecast. Well, Adam Woodall, you've probably heard of him. He's been a fixture of the North Vancouver music scene for over 20 years. He's a North Van guy. And Adam was among the first to really jump on board uh, when we were asking for support for Rotary's virtual North Vancouver Canada Day celebration. It's great to have him on the program. So here's Adam Woodall and a little help from his friends. Okay, you guys ready? All right, everybody. How's it going? Happy Canada Day. It's Adam Woodall here. I'm here with... Um, Emerson, my daughter Emerson, yeah. and who else? My sister Elliot. Elliot, and uh, we're going to just sing a song here. Uh, I hope everyone's having a great day. I hope everyone's being safe and uh, just enjoying your time today, hopefully with your family and uh, embracing this beautiful country that we live in. So here's a song by Johnny Cash. And it goes like this. Kevin, I'm a member of the Rotary Club of Lionsgate here in North Vancouver. I volunteer as a piano player at the Senior Homes, uh, North Shore Hospice, and Lionsgate Hospital. I miss seeing the residents and playing for them. I miss seeing the frontline workers. Thank you for doing such a great job. Um, I hope things get back to normal soon and we'll be get this show back on the road. Happy Canada Day. 
Congratulations. Happy Canada Day. Happy Canada Day. And our congratulations to all the grads of 2020. Here's a few more images, uh, great faces uh, from Canada days uh, gone by, and uh, that's when it was sunny. Um, not so today, so that's great that we're all inside enjoying this and some great, great faces. Thank you, folks. I love that village dental group, and then look at that little girl with those teeth up there. <laughs> it's wonderful. Well, our virtual celebration of Canada Day continues to be enriched by the mother load of musical talent here in North Van. And the North Van, uh, the North Shore Celtic Ensemble is a terrific example of just that. Thanks for having us. We're the North Shore Celtic Ensemble. We're so excited to be here. We're going to be playing a set of two songs called Divine Reel and Langstaff Library. Hope you guys enjoy. from Canadian Blood Services. Please join our community partners, businesses, and residents of the North Shore area to come and donate blood during the summertime. You can do this at our North Lonsdale United Church 
right here every two weeks or at the pipe shop location during the summertime. Happy Canada Day, everyone. Happy Canada Day! Happy Canada Day, Happy Canada Day from, from Upper Lonsdale Preschool. We wanted to give a shout out and say hello to all our students and all our families and thank our families and communities that have been with us and supporting us for the last 65 years. Happy Canada Day! Happy Canada Day! And lots of great greetings from uh, all over the North Shore today on this uh, Canada Day 2020, a virtual Canada Day here, courtesy of the Rotary Club of Lionsgate. And uh, some more faces of Canada Days gone by. <laughs> and uh, what is it? See, see you next year. That's the goatees down in the lower left there. And uh, yeah, we're seeing everybody again, but it's not quite as we had thought it might be, but fun all the same. Glad you're here. Well, the Benders, they've been around uh, North Van playing for the past 40 years. They've played almost every school, hall, bar, and club during that time. But I will bet this is their first virtual Canada Day gig. Thank you, Kevin and the Rotary, for having us. We are the Benders. Crazy times we're living in. We're lucky to be living in a country like Canada, so we hope you're healthy, happy, and safe, and feeling all right. Change of scenes. Every night I have the strangest dreams. Imprisoned by the way I could have been. Left it on my own. Door. So it seems I got to leave before I start to scream. Somebody locked the door and took the key. Feeling all right. I'm not feeling too good myself. Boy, Sean took me for one big night. Even now, I said, I wonder why. Oh, baby, when I think of oh, you, I start myself crying. Just can't waste my time. I'm not
Back to Canada Day. Day. Canada Day, um, what a land we live in, and I'm afraid that we're going to miss celebrating it as a community of faith this year because United Churches are not meeting in person, but um, we'll all be standing on guard for Canada on July 1st. The church has been here since 1912. I've been here about 10 years. I've gotten to work with a lot of community partners. Um, all the nonprofits um, on the North Shore, and together we do far more than you know, any of us could do alone. It's a wonderful community to live in. Every month we have jazz vespers. Um, some of the finest musicians in the Lower Mainland come and play on Sunday afternoons at four, the last Sunday of the month. Currently, to help with the COVID crisis, we are serving Meals to Go on Fridays from two to four. Happy Canada Day from me and everyone at St. Andrew's United Church. Happy Canada Day from the North Shore Meals on Wheels Society. Happy Canada Day from Vancouver. Well, it's just been great to see so many faces and so much goodwill and enthusiasm for our country and not surprising given the country in which we are graced to live. Um, some final photos to sort of say goodbye, but before we completely wrap up this virtual day celebration, we'd like to turn things over to, um, well, the guy who was a leader of this project. Stan? Hi, my name is Stan Van Werkens, and I'm the president at the Rotary Club of Lionsgate in North Vancouver. Amid all the up and down emotions of these last few challenging months, I've been experiencing an overriding feeling lately of gratitude. I'm grateful for the health of my family, for my colleagues, club members, for all of us here in North Vancouver. I'm also grateful for the outstanding community we are fortunate to be part of, and for all the essential workers on the front lines of this crisis who are demonstrating enormous effort and personal sacrifice to keep us safe. We received countless submissions capturing the appreciation we showed for our community. Thank you for your participation. Be kind, be calm, be safe, be together. Wish you a happy Canada Day. Till next time with the Rotary Club of Lionsgate. Thanks, Dan. Thanks, Rotary. And most of all, thank you. I hope you've enjoyed this uh, virtual celebration half as much as we've enjoyed sharing it with you. And next year, it's going to be great to see everyone back here at Waterfront Park. Happy Canada Day.